Hi, this is Ian Lamont from In 30 Minutes Guides. Today I'll be talking about how to hack the background color of Google Sites using a new feature called Themes. If this video helps, please take a moment to like it and follow me and let's get started. Here is Google Sites and Google recently added a new feature to Sites called Themes and you can make a custom theme and this custom theme allows you to do a little bit of a hack to change the background color. And by the way, the reason why I'm even trying this out is because people started asking me on other videos in the comments section, how can I change the background color of different pages on a Google site? So this is what I was able to come up with. By the way, this is not unlimited background colors on unlimited numbers of pages. It's only two or three colors you can choose from for all the pages you have. And it's basically using this themes feature. So here is a sample site that we have. Basically what you wanna do is you should see this, uh, this toolbar over on the right side, click on themes. This is new, create theme. So select that. And let's just call this test theme. And I'll call it test theme one. Okay, um, click next. Now, it gives you some preset colors, and there's actually lots of them, but you can also choose your own colors. So click on Custom Colors. Select these little drop-downs. So let's say that I wanted to make one of the background colors to be uh, this dark green color, and then I wanted another one to be a kind of a, uh, let's say, a red color, and then I wanted the third one to be a light color. So let's just say this kind of this gray color here. Then, click, then select Next, and then they'll ask you about the fonts that you want to use. So I'm just going to select Create Theme, because all I'm interested in is the colors. And you'll see that all of a sudden, the colors that were already there switched around. And that's because I had assigned each section its own, uh, its own background color based on one of the three options that I have. So I have three pages here, Home, Downloads, and Forms. Let's say that I want to change the background color on one particular page to red, the other one to green, and then the other one to white. This is how to do it. So first thing, you can't change the header. Um, the header is always going to be like that. But you can change these little sections. So let's do that. So let's make this one all red. OK? You basically have to go through and change each one to red, and so on. Okay, next, click on the next page that I have, the downloads page, and I want to make this one all green. Again, I can't change the header, but I can change this. So where's my style? That's interesting. I thought it was going to let me change it to green. All right, maybe not. So I have to, I have to use these other colors. Okay, so it's kind of like this uh, off green color. All right, and so on. And then for the third page, so this one actually has an image, so I'm just going to change that to something else. All right, and then again, for the section colors, I'm just going to choose white. So you can see this is not quite the same as changing the background color all, all around, but it's good enough for just a basic type of hack. Um, I wish there was an easier way to do this, but Google doesn't make it easy to do things like this, and I think they really want to control the appearance of the different sites that they have, but that's how it works. And by the way, one last step you, need, you would need to do is click Publish, and you'd be prompted to confirm whether you want to do that. For more information on how to get the most out of technology, mildly complex topics like uh, genealogy, Google Drive and Docs, uh, crowdfunding, go to in30minutes.com. We have a whole selection of books on these topics. Some of them have even won awards. Also, if this video helped you out, if you could like it and follow me, I'd be very grateful. This is Ian Lamont signing off. Thank you so much for watching.